Hi, you guys. This is Ping Pong Pig by Caroline Jane Church. And we picked this book because it's cute and it's also got the cutest little piggy on here, which is easy to draw. And uh, my mom, Joan King, will be drawing with you this pig along with a couple of characters from the book. So this is Ping Pong Pig. Here's the title page. Apple Tree Farm was a very busy place. Every day the animals would rush this way and that doing their daily chores. All the animals worked very hard indeed. All, that is, except one. Ping Pong Pig was far too busy doing his own thing. He spent all of his time trying to fly. He leaped from fences and logs, wheelbarrows and barrels trying to jump higher and higher. One day I will be able to fly, he told the other animals. Pigs can't fly, Ping Pong, they sighed. But Ping Pong never stopped jumping and leaping. He managed to ruin the apples, spoil the new paint on the barn, free the bees, and knock over the hay. The other animals decided that something had to be done. They gathered together for a meeting in the barn. Ping Pong wondered what was going on. The animals stayed in the barn all morning. They were obviously very busy. At last, the barn door swung open and the animals came out. Ping Pong looked on in amazement. We've made you this trampoline, they said. Now, take, uh, take it to a quiet corner of the field and let us get on with our work. Ping Pong climbed aboard the trampoline. He jumped and bounced and bounced and jumped. Whee! I can fly, he squealed. But pigs can't fly, Ping Pong, the animals sighed as they got on with their work. Ping Pong, Pig was having the best time ever. But then he stopped to think a little. It was so kind of my friends to make me this presence. So perhaps I should help them a little more as a way of saying thank you. He decided to put his trampoline to better use. the apples and caught the bees. He repainted the barn and carefully stacked all the hay. Much to his surprise, Ping Pong rather enjoyed helping out his friends and his friends were delighted. No more trouble from Ping Pong Pig, they said, until something caught their eye. High up at the top of the old apple tree, they noticed something rustling. It was Ping Pong Pig. Look, shouted Ping Pong as he leaped from the branches. Pigs can fly. No, Ping Pong, cried the animals. But it was too late. Splash! Ping Pong landed in the middle of the pond. Wow, fish can fly too, he giggled. And that's it, that's the end. So you guys will be drawing a little ducky and chick from the story too. All right, see you next time.